Hello, everyone. Are you ready to forgive the mistakes of new drivers instead of raging and attacking them? If your answer is yes, then you are certainly a polite and tolerant person. But this video will give you a new perspective on what might happen to those who answer no. A road rage incident occurred on the highway between a woman driving a Mercedes and a man driving a Jeep. The two had conflicts for a long time because both thought the other person was endangering them. The rage became more intense when the man tried to force the woman to the side of the road, but the woman suddenly braked, causing the Jeep to lose control and flip over to everyone's surprise. Luckily, the man in the car was taken out safely. The drunk truck driver irrationally took out his anger on the sedan and even three other cars traveling in the same direction. But he could not escape justice, as just a few minutes later, he was arrested at a nearby police station. After the police arrested him and tested his urine, it was discovered that he had many stimulants in his body. The incident occurred in Nipomo, California. A minor altercation earlier had already left both men angry and swearing at each other, even throwing plastic cups at one another's faces. Just when it seemed like things wouldn't calm down, a police patrol car on the opposite side witnessed the entire event and quickly intervened. Road rage occurred on the highway between the driver of a black sedan, who suddenly changed lanes when he noticed the truck in front was quite close to him. This made the red car behind him angry, and the two had a conflict. The two pushed each other for a long distance, and their rage ended with the black car losing control and crashing into the roadside railing and being thrown up. Everyone in the car is fine, but this is also a lesson for all of us that controlling our emotions and actions is extremely important. The heavy rain that had just happened made the road too slippery for everyone to go fast, but this made the busy man unable to wait any longer. He decided to speed up and leave, but soon regretted this decision. His car lost control and crashed into a lamppost. Fortunately, he wasn't injured, but in the end, hurrying didn't get him home any faster. This incident happened in Texas, when a man driving a sedan tried to overtake Henry from the left, almost causing a serious accident. It seemed like the situation was over, but moments later, the man drove ahead and brandished an ax out of his car window, as if to threaten Henry. His anger and distraction quickly cost him. When he crashed into another sedan, going in the same direction, severely damaging both cars. The man was dissatisfied with the car in front when he arbitrarily changed lanes. This made him angry and forced the driver behind him to get out of the car to deal with his anger. But nearby police were immediately present and escorted him to the station. Eliminate any thought of racing on the highway as soon as it pops into your head, because this will likely be the result when that thought is accepted and acted upon. Two women screamed and cursed at each other, trying to blame one another for a previous incident. The woman in the white car even threw plastic bottles at the woman behind her. Surprisingly, a bottle accidentally fell into the car of the man who was filming. He was quite confused 
and didn't know how to handle the bottle when it happened so suddenly. If you were this man, what would you do with the bottle? Share your thoughts in the comments so we can discuss. Rage broke out between a man driving a motorbike and a woman driving a Toyota. When they met on a narrow road, the man believed she had entered his lane, preventing him from moving. The woman also admitted her fault, so she changed lanes to the right to give way to him. It seemed like the woman was a new driver. What's worth mentioning here is that the man stopped and waited for the woman to change lanes. But he didn't take his foot out of the lane when her car passed and got angry and smashed her car window. The man driving the sedan suddenly jumped up and squeezed into George Lane while he was traveling on the highway. George honked the horn, but this made the man in the sedan angry. He got out of the car and repeatedly challenged George to get out of the car to deal with his rage with him. When you drive the safest car in the world, but the way you control the car turns the car into a bad one. A small incident caused a conflict between these people. All three decided to stop and resolve the issue right on the road. What do you think about this situation? Share your thoughts in the comments so we can discuss. Hopefully this video and the previous incidents will give you a new perspective and help you choose a wiser way to react. A conflict that occurred in a previous incident caused two men driving a moto to decide to chase and block the sedan, screaming. Everything seemed to be over when everyone left. But as soon as he reached the red light, the man driving the moto rushed into the driver of the sedan to vent his rage. This provoked the sedan driver to retaliate. The altercation that occurred during an earlier incident caused the man in the SUV to get out of his car and rush towards the driver of the Toyota to vent his anger. But as soon as he stuck his face inside to scream, he was hit with pepper spray. His rage quickly turned to tears. A previous conflict caused the young man in the Chevrolet to rush out of the car with a baseball bat to vent his rage. But his rage was quickly extinguished when a large man stepped out of the car behind him. The rampage occurred when the van driver tried to overtake and claimed that the pickup truck in front did not give way to him but his attempt to overtake and cut off the pickup caused his van to run off the road. The rage occurred when the man driving the sedan changed lanes into the lane of the man driving the moto. This made the moto rider angry because he thought it was dangerous for him. Everything seemed to be over when the man driving the moto suddenly overtook and kicked the sedan and then fell onto the street. Just one simple reason made the sedan angry. And in the end, he was the recipient of his own karma.
The man driving the sedan was going slow on the road, which made the SUV driver angry. The SUV driver sped up and cut off the sedan. He got angry and check brakes the car behind him. But this also caused him to lose control and crash into the SUV in the same lane. A previous incident caused the man driving the pickup truck to become angry and rush towards the BMW. Ultimately, the road rage ends and no one wins when they decide to engage in road rage. The most practical way to get home safely is to stay calm and more importantly, accurately assess your own abilities. Speeding can get you home faster, but it can also lead to trouble. So think twice before you hit the gas. Smiling and moving on when you encounter an aggressive driver might help everyone have a safer trip. This man driving a moto suddenly overtook and attacked the sedan without any reason. In the end, he is the one who receives the karma he created. The trailer suddenly changed lanes and cut in front of the van. This caused both of them to attack each other and curse. Luckily, everyone left and tensions did not escalate. Your trip will be safer if you control your anger, because you will not know what you will face. Maybe that was in your plan, but it could also make you worse. Joy is on her way to her office in Boise, Idaho. Then a man driving a moto was going too slow at the entrance of the highway. This caused Joy to honk the horn to warn him, but this made him angry and suddenly stopped causing Joy to lose control and lunge at him. This low-speed incident cost Joy's insurance company $100,000 in damages. And it is worth mentioning that neither side can agree on who is at fault. Who do you think is at fault in this situation? Comment number one if you think it's the moto driver's fault. Comment number two if you think it's Joy's fault. The conflict began when two vehicles turned into the same lane. The driver of the black sedan believed that the white SUV had deliberately failed to yield. This caused the driver to quickly rush up and cut off the SUV. Immediately, the driver of a black sedan carrying a baseball bat rushed into the man driving the SUV who was holding an axe to vent his rage. Luckily, everyone chose to leave after that. Rage occurs when the van suddenly overtakes, causing the driver of the moto to go into a rage and chase the van to vent his rage. But this made him forget that he was driving a moto and going in the opposite direction. Hopefully this will be a lesson for us about calmness. The conflict that occurred earlier made the man driving the Cadillac decide to stop right on the highway to vent his anger. However, as soon as he jumped out of the car, he had to quickly get back because the police car was there immediately. A previous incident caused a dispute between two men right in front of the gas station exit. It seemed like everything had ended when the man in the black shirt left but he suddenly returned and attacked the man in the Jeep. The two then rushed at each other, but the man in black was quickly knocked out by multiple sprays from a pepper spray canister.
The rage began when the motorcyclist hit the car's side mirror and then fled. This enraged the retired man in the car, who decided to chase the young motorcyclist at 50 miles per hour through quiet residential streets. The entire incident was recorded by the driver's own dashcam, despite his initial lie that it was broken. He was ultimately sentenced to eight months in jail for dangerous driving and obstructing the police. This road rage began when the man with the dash cam decided to overtake, after noticing the SUV driver slowing down. But this angered the SUV driver, who sped up and blocked the dash cam driver's way. He got out of his car with a baton, but dropped it in his rage. The man driving this moto decided to demonstrate the power of his motorcycle by letting the SUV inhale the smoke. However, just when it seemed he would ride away with his head held high, the reality was quite the opposite. <laughs> The rage began when the man in the Opal changed lanes upon noticing that his lane was congested, but changed his mind at the last minute. He then tried to squeeze back into the lane for what seemed like a long time. It seemed like everything had ended until the man in the passenger seat got out of the car, started yelling, and took a picture of the other driver's license plate while both cars were waiting at a red light. However, it is worth mentioning that the driver did not know that the passenger had gotten off the bus, so he left. A previous incident caused both vehicles to have a dispute and chase each other on the highway. Finally, the Jeep suddenly braked, causing the sedan to lose control and crash into the Jeep, flipping both vehicles. Hopefully, this video will serve as a lesson for all of us to remain calm in every situation. In his rage, the man driving this moto thought that the moto's feet and speed would help him destroy the bike, weighing several tons. The man in the sedan attempted to make a right turn despite another sedan already moving. What's worth mentioning is that, as soon as his intention failed, he got angry at the driver behind him. But his anger was quickly extinguished by the pepper spray. A previous incident had caused the man to fly into a rage and kick the woman's SUV. This escalated the tension when she decided to step on the gas and speed up. Anyone in a fit of rage is frightening, even if it's a woman. This is why we should always stay calm. Do you agree that using pepper spray is an effective way to deal with road rage? Please leave your opinion below in the comment section. The man driving this sedan suddenly accelerated past the moto, trying to show off the power of his car. However, karma struck swiftly as his car lost control and veered off the road before coming to a stop. The 
The consequences of rage are never part of your plan, so the way to prevent it is by staying calm and respectful. Klein was driving along Sardis Road in Murraysville, Pennsylvania, when he encountered a traffic jam caused by a man raging at an elderly woman driving a sedan. His rage ended when the police arrived and took him to the station. Every fit of anger brings negative consequences, so I hope you stay calm in every situation. Don't try to make things worse when you're angry. A man fell asleep in his car while waiting at a red light. George went to wake him. And as soon as the man woke up, George immediately regretted his decision. It's clear to all of us that rage at the police and trying to escape in heavy traffic has never been a good idea. This truck driver decided to teach the sedan driver a lesson about changing lanes and brake check others. Do you agree with his actions? Share your thoughts in the comments below. The incident occurred in Queensland when a previous altercation triggered the man in this sedan to unleash his rage on John right on the highway. He repeatedly brake checked John in his fit of anger. Things didn't stop there, when this man decided to chase John all the way to the police station and rush towards John to continue venting his rage. He was eventually charged with dangerous operation of a motor vehicle, driving without a license, disturbing public order and obstructing police. Big lesson by the valve driver. The dispute occurred during a previous incident which resulted in the man screaming at the van driver because he thought the van was going in the wrong lane and almost endangering him. But this made everyone in the van quickly get out and rush towards him. <laughs> A previous conflict had caused two men to rush into each other to vent their rage. Everything seemed to be over. Then suddenly, the young man kicked the rear of the van hard. This caused the van driver to immediately rush towards him and respond. Luckily, the rampage ended when the woman dissuaded him. The rage happened when the man driving this sedan tried to squeeze into the congested lane. But he was the one who got angry when he wasn't given the right of way. He aggressively rushed out of the car to scream, but this caused him to forget to use the handbrake and get into another incident. The conflict began when the driver of the truck honked at the man driving the white sedan as the light turned green. That made the sedan driver angry and quickly rushed up to block the truck to vent his rage. But quickly, the man received his karma when he was hit with pepper spray from the truck driver.
The man in the sedan attempted to make a right turn despite another sedan already moving. What's worth mentioning is that, as soon as his intention failed, he got angry at the driver behind him. But his anger was quickly extinguished by the pepper spray. This man's motorbike suddenly stalled, causing him to struggle to start it. But the driver in the sedan didn't have the patience to wait for him, so he decided to speed up and pass. In the end, instead of getting home on time, he destroyed his car himself. Mike was on his way to work in California when he encountered two cars chasing each other due to a previous road rage incident. Things worsened when the sedan sped up and cut in front of the pickup truck, causing it to lose control and crash into another sedan in the same lane. The speed was so fast that the sedan left the highway in just a few seconds. Hopefully, this video will serve as a lesson for all of us about staying calm. This woman slowly pushed her child to walk right in the middle of the street, hindering everyone's movement. However, as soon as she was reminded, she became angry and threw her newly purchased cup of coffee at the driver. If you were in this situation, what would you do? The rage happened when this man tried to cross the street, despite the street light being green. The sound of a car horn made him angry, and he rushed towards the oncoming driver. But his aggression was quickly quelled by pepper spray as he rushed to the car door. A previous incident made the two sedan drivers furious and chased each other on the highway. Things got worse when the Volkswagen driver stubbornly overtook a truck that was approaching. This led to him wrecking his own car, but luckily he was fine. This man's name was Joseph Ward, and he decided to crash his car into Inspector Tony McGovern in a fit of road rage. In the end, Ward was sentenced to four years in prison for his rampage. A previous misunderstanding caused the man in the sedan to fly into a rage and suddenly block the car the man was approaching. He ferociously took the hockey stick and rushed forward. But before he could vent his anger, he received a full blow from the pepper spray. A previous incident caused the gray car to speed up and block the orange car. Quickly, the man in the orange car got out of the car with the baseball bat, but suddenly he was snatched from his hand by the man in the blue shirt. In the end, he had to quickly get into his car and leave. The rage started when the sedan driver suddenly stopped at the pedestrian crossing. This caused the man in white shirt to rush into the other driver to vent his rage. Things became more tense when the two rushed into each other right in the middle of a crowded street. Eventually, the sedan driver got back into his car and left. There are many reasons to get angry, but this video is the reason why you need to calm down. You never know who you might be dealing with in a moment of rage, so keeping your cool is always the best way to ensure you get home safely. This incident happened in Taiwan. When a previous conflict made these two men angry, and holding a baseball bat to chase the man driving the Toyota. 
Things gradually became more tense when the man holding a baseball bat decided to smash the Toyota's window hard, and the driver of the Toyota also decided to respond. A previous incident caused two men to charge at each other in a fit of rage. However, his anger was quickly extinguished by a burst of pepper spray. The rage happened when the man driving a black SUV overtook in the right lane and yelled at the moto driver because he said he could not drive in the left lane. After a while of screaming, this man decided to pass left in the opposite lane and brake check the man driving the moto. But all this, the sedan driver saw and decided to quickly brake check with the SUV driver. This guy thinks he can sneak in front of this safe driver. Little does he know he's about to be in a world of car repair trouble. The outcomes of road rage are never part of your plan. So we hope this video serves as a vivid example of the consequences of road rage. A previous incident involved a road rage conflict between an SUV driver and a bus driver. Things became more tense when the man driving the SUV held an iron rod and smashed it into the bus. In the end, the bus driver chose to leave rather than try to confront the aggressive guy. In his rage, a Nissan driver in New York used a baseball bat to smash a brand new 2018 Subaru just to deal with his anger over a minor collision. He was eventually arrested and jailed for his actions. Time for this woman is more precious than safety. So she chose to clear the snow right on the highway. When reminded, she even flew into a rage. Many people might do anything to confront you just to deal with their anger. But how you choose to react to the situation will determine the outcome of that rage. Hope everyone always keeps calm. This time, the rage happened when the man driving the gray car drove slower and refused to give way, causing the man in the white car to become angry. So he got out of the car, kicked off the rearview mirror of the gray car, and left as if nothing had happened. The two chased each other for a long distance until the police forced them to stop. 